The Isolate is a device that is primarily aimed at self-education in areas where students don't have enough teachers and also areas where you may not have enough electric power to supply and run complete computers. <laughs> Our present target audience are fifth and sixth grade students in largely in the, in the region of southern India for the time being. There's a severe shortage of teachers in many of these schools. So the first thing you think about when you go to an area where people don't have resources is to sell something at a very low cost or make something at a very low cost. So a low cost PC by itself, the standard interface with no additional innovation is not going to be engaging. So what do we do? We look at the student to the book exercise interaction as a complex process. We use lessons from cognitive psychology through our partners who are experts in that to evaluate how a user experience is benefiting the person you're actually giving the slate to. Part of it is you'd want to stay with it and use it. So this is the current view of the I slate as we are going to deploy it in India. You have four subjects loaded in it, basically everything except languages. So we are going to the textbook mode and we are going to the workbook. This asks me what is zero plus nine. So being a smart person will say it's nine. So it said a smiley face, I did the right thing. 28 minus 10 equal to, we know it's 18, but let me just say it is 17, it's wrong, and it records it in red so that when I come back, it will cue me to solve this correct problem. The more you do successfully and the better you are, this character starts showing a lot of life and is healthy and well. If you don't work for a long time or you're doing poorly, the, the character starts drooping and actually in a danger zone when you're really being tardy, it asks you to feed it by virtue of training. And this supposedly has been very successful in Japan in motivating elders to play on games for keeping the brain active and stimulated. So not just for myself, but my partners who work with me on this project from overseas, this has been a very moving experience. When we go to this village and actually see these children using these devices, it's phenomenal as to how capable, bright, and motivated they are, and this is in the fourth or fifth grade. When you meet these students, the rate at which they can solve problems, the speed, the grasp, and their enthusiasm is just unrivaled compared to any school that I've seen.